and this is it Alpna here in this video we are going to solve this differential equation so let's get started problem solve x squared minus ay into dx equals to ax minus y squared into dy solution given differential equation x square minus a y into d x equals to a x minus y square into d y. Then, so consider it as equation 1 or we can reduce this as or we can rewrite this as x square minus a y into d x minus a x minus y square into d y equals to 0. We can consider this as equation one okay so the equation is of m dx plus n dy equals to zero form right now if we compare these two we'll get that m equals to x square minus a y and n equals to minus of ax minus y square which is equals to minus ax plus y square okay fine if do m by do y equals to do n by do x then we can say that this equation is an exact equation okay or the given equation is an exact equation so first we will find do m by do y do m by do y derivative of and partial derivative of m with respect to y is do y dou by dou y of x square minus a y. So here we are using with respect to y. So we'll treat x and a as constant. So this equals to derivative of x square with respect to y is 0 minus a into derivative of y with respect to y is 1. This equals to minus a. Now coming to dou n by dou x is equals to dou by dou x of n minus ax plus y square here we are having with respect to x right so we'll treat y square and a as constant so derivative of minus ax is minus a into dou x by dou x plus Derivative of constant that is y square is 0 is equal to minus a. Derivative of x with respect to x is 1. So you get minus a into 1 is minus a. So you are having dou m by dou y equals to dou n by dou x which is equal to minus a. So therefore dou m by dou y equals to dou n by dou x. Therefore. 1 is an exact equation. Fine. Now, firstly, Integrating m with respect to x, treating y as constant. Integral over x, m into dx equals to 
integral of x square minus a y into dx. So here we have to treat y as constant, right? So here we have y constant and a is also treated as constant. So this is equals to, let's write the constants outside the integral then simply you can split integral x square dx minus treat a y as constant. So you will get minus a y outside the integral into integral dx. This equals to integral x square dx is x cube by 3 minus a y into integral dx is x. So this equals to x cube by 3 minus a x y. Right? Consider it as 2. Now, second one We'll find integral of terms not containing terms of n not containing x terms of n not containing x or free from x we can say. So let's find the terms of n free from x. We have only one term which is free from x. y square. Integral y square into dy equals to y cube by 3. Considered as equation sorry number 3. So the general solution of the given equation is 2 plus 3 equals to integral constant C. Therefore, the general solution of 1 is 2 plus 3 equals to C. Then, we are having 2x cubed by 3 minus axy plus 3y cubed by 3 equals to integral constant C. You can write this as x cubed minus 3axy plus y cube by 3 equals to c then x cube minus 3 a x y plus y cube equals to 3 c since c being constant so you can write 3 c as c then x cube minus 3 a x y plus y cube equals to c is the required general solution. So we have seen a problem from exact equation in this video. Hope you will understand. We will see you in the next video. Until then, bye bye.